Now to a shocking case of classroom corporal punishment right here in Metro Detroit. The investigation into school beating accusations is unfolding at Washington Parks Academy in Redford Township. 7 Action News reporter Alan Campbell sat down with parents and the students who say they were hit. The parents of these children say this kind of behavior is inappropriate, especially from a teacher in the classroom who's supposed to be educating their kids. I was furious. I was very concerned. Um, my daughter called me crying hysterically. Parents Lakeisha Mason and Robin Davidson say what happened to their children in the classroom at Washington Parks Academy is unacceptable. It was an incident that occurred with several students and that the teacher was escorted from the building. My child was hit. She even still says that her head, like where she was hit at, is sore. Third graders Jeremy Mason and Chloe Davidson say their teacher came up to them with a ruler, then suddenly hit them. He allowed it us to go to the um, to the office to sharpen our pistols. Then we did that. We came back and he started hitting us with the paddles. I got hit by the side of my head by a ruler. Um, some of my friends got pulled by the hair. Lakeisha and Robin both filed police reports with Redford PD. The school sent us a statement that reads in part, we received news of an allegation made by students about misconduct on the part of a substitute teacher at one of our schools. We are currently conducting an investigation into this allegation. They need to do a thorough background check on everybody that they have come into the school. Lakeisha and Robin say their children need to be nurtured in school and not shown any type of violence or physical abuse. You can't just go around paddling kids because they didn't do something that they were supposed to do. If I don't feel safe with him around my child, I don't feel safe with him around nobody kid. Too much, too much is happening out here already. Both parents say the next step is to hire a lawyer and press charges. Reporting in Redford, I'm Alan Campbell, 7 Action News.